so I am going to be sharing how to use Edmodo today. Um, so I've already created a profile on Webmodo. Um, I used my Gmail login, so you have an option to do that. You could also just use an email and create a password and create your account that way. I just think it's easiest to um, use Gmail to sign into things when I can because then I don't have to remember as many passwords. So um, in Edmodo, then you can go in. It's basically a, an online classroom, kind of a lot very similar to Google Classroom, I'm finding as I play around with it. Um, so I went ahead and I already put in my name. I teach prep kindergarten through sixth grade music. Um, it, when you put it in, it uh, you have to select creative arts teacher for music, and then you can select music as kind of the subcategory that you have to select a creative arts teacher. Um, I could add the year that I started. I could always also add a picture um, so that I've got a picture connected to my account as well. Um, so then you can go through and you can invite uh, different teachers within your building. So I've already connected with a few teachers in my building um, and they're, they're showing up here, teachers that I've worked with that kind of show up in my email already. And so I can um, connect with some of those teachers and uh, I have not quite discovered what you can do when you connect with those teachers. I don't know if you can share things. I assume you can add them as collaborators in your um, classrooms as well. So if I go to my home page, um, this is my home page. So then I can go in and oh, so this is my home page. So this is where my classes will show up. So along the left hand side, there are my classes. I've already created a class. So this is my sixth grade class that I've created here. So when I go into that class, then um, I can add students. So you can add students by sending them an email or you can give them a class code, just like with Google Classrooms, if you've used that before. Um, and so then I can also post things. So I can post announcements, um, assignments. I can post a quiz if I want to or a poll, uh, kind of like a Google form. Um, and things will show up in my calendar over here. Uh, you can also go up here to what is due and see what um, what assignments you have here, what assignments you've already looked at, and then um, assignments that you have scheduled to be posted at a later date. So you can schedule things ahead of time, which is really nice. You can also see the progress for different students and classes. You can go to your library that has um, different things that you've posted. So again, I think it's very, very similar to Google Classrooms if you've used that. Um, and you can even connect your Google Drive, which is really nice. So pretty friendly and easy to use.